So my name is Jay Sol. I'm known as Chip of War. Um, the installation behind me is uh, an exhibition I put together called Built on Genocide. Um, it's about the, uh, the decimation of, of the bison in the, in the plains uh, that was perpetrated uh, on executive order from John A. Macdonald as a means of clearing the plains um, to make room for uh, settlers, but also clearing the plains um, uh, for the railroad. There are over 1,300 individually carved skulls in this installation, representing for the artist not only the often mistold story of the bison, but the history of Indigenous peoples across North America. At the same time, it was uh, used as a means of starving Indigenous people off their lands uh, to steal their land and their resources. It's really uh, correcting the history books how the, the, the buffalo were, were decimated due to overhunting, and that's not actually true. At the time of contact, there were more than 60 million uh, buffalo roaming North America. It was a just strategic genocide as a means of striving indigenous people off, their, off of their land. It's hugely frustrating that it's, uh, the true narrative isn't taught in schools because um, it, it's what uh, contributes to the systemic racism uh, directed towards indigenous people. The installation at Harborfront is part of the Luminato Festival. It took over seven months to create the skulls, and Chippewa hopes it and the accompanying art pieces will spark dialogue and change. You know, for me, choosing this is sort of like a jumping off point so people understand that A, the history that you're taught in schools is a, is a, nar a false narrative. Um, and then B, it just sort of shows like the beginning of the eco-terrorism and uh, the di complete disregard for the land and the animals and the water that happens in Canada. And that, that's a very long history that's happened since, the, you know, the, the 1800s up until present day. And all of those are um, connected to where we are as Indigenous people in, 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 you know, in the stolen occupied territory of Canada. To see all of the art installations happening, you can go to our website, citynews.ca slash extras. At Harbor Front, Audra Brown, City News.